Everyone knows about our culture, but we as a people, in my opinion, don't harness it. We don't bring no benefit from it. Being African American as an artist, that's the only dilemma I see. Everything that we created, everyone's benefiting from that. But the black man who created that, is he benefiting from it? Are his children benefiting from it? That's where I see myself doing it. I'm gonna benefit from the work I do. <laughs> Too many of our people feel that this sneaker or whatever kind of sneaker is so important that they would kill over it. And that's why you see a lot of these newspaper clippings are about someone being killed or stabbed or shot over a pair of sneakers. That's why the word caution, usually caution tape is used when there's some kind of danger going on. So I'm trying to tell our people to be careful to not become, get into materialism, to not become uh, materialistic. And I, he's saying, saying Jordan is not Nike's heir. Michael Knight is the owner of Nike. So he's, his heirs are his children, not Michael Jordan. But there are two heads playing jazz. And there are two hands playing hip hop music. I'm scratching a record. But I'm ultimately saying it was one black body created hip hop and jazz here. And then this term, we beat, D beat, DT is basically like when you're playing Bebop, you're going really fast, and that's the type of sound that comes out of there. And those hands represent the DJs that started off hip hop with the music and the scratching and the break beats that created uh, break dancing. You have to express your uniqueness in your art. For me, it's jazz, it's hip hop, Islam, it's African American history, it's Harlem, my children, my wife, being poor at one point in life, being on welfare as a kid, not really being close to my father, all those things, that's me, that's who I am. Does Allah like what I'm doing? That's how I go about doing this, you know? I do believe that there's a racist environment in America, but I would never draw a picture of Trump uh, being stabbed by a black man and him blood coming. That's to me, those are extremes. That's how al um affects my artwork. I can never go to extreme because uh, an Al-Islam is frowned upon. <laughs>